You up, babe? Mm hmm I'm still tired, though. You know what I could use? I could use some coffee. Hmm. Coffee? Mm hmm You know, that's something that works better than coffee, right? <laughs> you play too much. Mm, mm, mm. Coffee, please, sir. Just saying, you know. Ugh. You know I'm glad I met you. <laughs> For soulmates, remember? That was just a dream. Yo. Yeah. What's good, bro? Yeah. Uh, a lot happened, man. I'll update you when I get home. I'm in a Airbnb right now. Should be home in a few hours. All right, bro. All right, dude. Later. <laughs> Nah, you look like shit. I feel like shit, so. Cairo, you gotta get yourself together, beloved. You drinking whiskey out of a fucking mug. You say you want to talk, man. Yeah, I've been trying to talk to you for the past half hour. Oh. Well, yeah. I'm dead out of it, I guess. Uh, a Johnny. A Johnny's been compromised. Like Code Red, Defcon 15, Black Hawk Down. Wait, what do you mean, comp? Who else would I be speaking about? Marisol. Fuck. Should have fucking known. You goddamn right, you should have fucking known. I thought you said Gary had the handle. I did. All right, dude. But yo, this is good news. How is this good news? Because all I have to do now is just tell Johnny what happened. I don't think it's gonna be that simple. Why not? Man, have you met a Johnny? Yes. Yes, I met a Johnny. And all I have to do is tell her what happened and everything will be behind us. Okay. You know what will be behind you guys? Marisol with a butcher knife. Come on, don't fucking say that shit. That's... Yo, Johnny vanishing for a bit is actually a good thing. Because now all you got to do is close that chapter with Marisol close the TV deal, and come back to AJ with all your shit here. That's the least you can do. You know what? You have a point, sir. Yeah, I'm just trying to look out for you, man. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hey, hey, uh, yeah, sorry. Uh, I had a family emergency. Everything's all right. <clears throat> now you're sober, huh? Tonight? Yeah, yeah, tonight, yeah, for sure. I, I, I can meet you guys. Yeah, sounds good. All right, all right, take care. All right. Fuck. I gotta go. Wow. Yeah, all right. Hey. 
Spare keys are supposed to be used for emergencies. Yeah. Uh, what happened was it... Ah. How are you? Mm. <laughs> I'm good, actually. I, um, about to head out. What's up with you? How are you? Mm -hmm. well, just got bailed out of jail, but it's all good. What? You was locked up? No, but you've been ghost, so how do uh, you know? Come on. Don't do that. You scared the hell out of me. Just saying. How can I? I'm just... Working, you know. Being booed up, right? No front, I mean, no. Yeah. About that. Wait, what's going on? Mm. Yeah, don't make me have to come back here and beat your little boyfriend up. All right? Listen, I could just make one phone call and it could be handled. You know that. <laughs> Maybe you should. Damn, what's this? What's going on, sis? What's happening? So, I already told you how I met Kyra. Gave him a chance, and um, his little girlfriend rolled up on me, wanting to talk woman to woman. Wait, the preppy little travel blogger? Mm. He managed to bag two chicks from the hood? What? Uh, what the hell does that mean? I'm just saying, any chick that's willing to confront you woman to woman is bold. Clearly she was with the shits. So, I'm going to ignore you trying to call me ratchet, okay? <laughs> but no, nah, she wasn't crazy. She just... Look crazy as hell. Mm -hmm. So she looked crazy and you still believed her? Why shouldn't I believe her? Okay. In the words of the great fabulous... Oh, boy. Hating hoes ain't happy and happy hoes ain't hating. <sighs> right. Because that's philosophy. Yeah. Listen, sis, I be giving you these proverbs for free. <laughs> so I need you to listen. <laughs> if he was treating her right, she would be happy. Right. What it sounds like to me is the ex that got curved. What's he saying about it? Um, I don't know. Because I haven't spoken to him. I've kind of um, been avoiding the situation ever since. <sighs> oh, so you want to go? All right. Now, what the hell is that supposed to mean? <sighs> That's it. I'm just saying you be Olympic high jumping to conclusions without letting the man explain. Whatever, you know. Men ain't shit. How's that? Uh, I love you, sis. You know that. But uh, you ain't shit either. What the hell? Just saying. <laughs> <laughs> Whose side are you on anyways? I mean, and I know you didn't come all the way over here to tell me about myself. Listen, what would you tell me if I came at you with the same thing about a girl that was doing this to me? So see, um, that's different, okay? Oh, so like the time when you first... Ah, uh, actually, I gotta go. We can't even get into all of that. But obviously, um, I'm gonna be seeing you later, right? I guess. Later. All right, sis. Shit, you just drop the air. Right. Just come in the air. You <laughs> running. You. You damn don't air. Run. Run. Ugh. Shit. Don't take your damn shoes off in my house. Man. Already? Already in the process. Oh. You got juice, by the way? Spray in the closet. No, Henny. That's the juice I like, no? You got porn on your t- Sit inside <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> so it was my TV remote the whole time, not my car. <laughs> mm. <Yeah. Funny. laughs> you know, it's crazy. <laughs> uh. Uh, right, so, um, it was something that you had something to say to me? Yeah, 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 right, 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 right. Um, yeah, I was just gonna say, um, I like, I like your eyebrows. I mean, um, what I meant to say was, you like the perfect beat, the perfect beat over a really tight burst. Oh, wait. A perfect person with a really tight beat, you know what I'm saying? Did you just fall for sugar? Damn, girl, how do you know that? Oh, God. I should have known you were going to waste my time. No, no, no. I, I could explain. Like, All I right? Mean, hurry up. Okay, so I remember. <sighs> I wonder what Cairo's doing. Oh, this is the same place I was with him. It, this is ridiculous. Oh. Look, I was just really hyped that you were feeling me like that because. I'm digging you like. <laughs> Pause. Do not quote Love Jones, okay? Come on, girl. Everybody loves that movie. Uh, 
Yeah, but I just don't want you to ruin it for me. Come on, girl. There's got to be something that you like about me. You came out on this date, right? This, this ain't no date. Okay, uh, I'm buying you drinks after I told you I liked you. Bro, you, you've been groveling the whole time. Hmm. Sounds like a date to me. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 wait. Am I a rebound? Oh. I've been been to be a side nigga for years. <laughs> Unless your man can fight. You know, I, I'll have to pass if you did in a box or something like that. All right. Who are you texting right now? <sighs> so now that we have a deal, we have a flight booked for you on Sunday. Sunday? That's three days from now. Yeah, we have to get right to it. Will that be a problem? No, no, no. I don't think it should be a problem. Um, can it be late Sunday night? <laughs> you can flight you want, man. Uh, <laughs> and remember you mentioned before that I could, I will have a tour guide that roll with me in like every country, right? Right. Exactly. Fresh face you interact with as you go on your journey. Hmm. Can I pick the tour guide? No can do. Sorry, but each one has to be approved by the network. You want to stand, right? Yeah, but isn't that a little staged though? You know, a lot of my followers like my blog because of like the realness of it. Honey, this is show business. That tour guide that you have will be a carefully selected model that's a native of the country. You'll be the next James Bond. Calm under pressure, uh, smooth with the ladies. You know, you can be able to showcase all the international treasures of the world. Mm. James Bond, huh? Mm -hmm. Are you guys going to have me fighting off? bad guys i mean are you up for that <laughs> did i tell you he was up for that See, i told you he's gonna be so, up for that. this is a travel show <laughs> not mission impossible it's not even the same movie forgive him he used to work for spike tv if you can turn downtown abbey into a michael bay film he would okay <laughs> what the fuck i'm cool with that just johnny I just wanted to let you know how much range that we feel that That has to be a Johnny. What is that? Huh? Oh, um, sorry. Could you guys just give me for a second? Oh, um, this is cute. Or whatever. Um, I'm actually gonna head out now. Oh, damn, you okay? Need another drink? How long is Ron on? Carol, what are you doing here? Well, if you answer your phone, you know, I have a business meeting right now. Nice. Maybe you should get back to that. Oh. Hey, Norm, you should leave this in three days. That's really all you have to say. I haven't been ignoring you. I've just been with you. I mean, you've been texting me just fine. Actually, you text a lot. Like, shut up, enough. Sonny. Right. Stay out of this. All right. Why? Why is this the dude that was at the party I met you at? Wow. Look, I can date whoever I want to date, Kyrie. Mm -hmm. You don't own me. I'm saying I can't about owning you. I just don't understand how we go from long walks on the beach to you ignoring me for two weeks and three days. <sighs> two weeks and three days. That's that's 17 days. That's like the Usher song. 79, 14 hours, 12, 11, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, you're embarrassing us. Oh, so they're still in us. This is fucking ridiculous, man. You know what? I'm not doing this. What? Excuse me. Man. This is probably a bad time, but you're still good to get these drinks. It's been a weird night. My day just walked out on me, as you can see. You know? That's enough. That's enough. That's enough. Running outside for a second, guys. So you're not, you're not gonna get these drinks. I don't get why you would offer to get these drinks if you're not gonna get them. Negro. I'm surprised you just didn't disappear on me again. That was the plan. 
I um I honestly just can't believe you. I honestly can't believe you. You just evaporate into thin air without having me explain anything. I don't have to let you do anything. I mean, <laughs> you out here with a whole fiance. Fiance? Is that what she told you? She's lying to you. She just doesn't want us to be together. Mm, I don't believe that. She's not just gonna say that just to say it. So you're really gonna take the word of a random woman you don't know over me? I don't have any reason to trust you. You don't have any reason to trust her. You know me. Do I? Yeah, yeah you do. You're just scared. Excuse you. You heard me. You're just scared to be in a relationship. So instead of hearing me out, you're gonna go on fucking dates with lame dudes like that. It wasn't even a date. Oh, sure as hell looked like one. But you know what? Since I trust you, uh, I'm gonna take your word for it. You're a liar. What have I lied about? Tell me one thing. Uh, Whatever. I got the deal. Good for you. I can leave in three days. Have fun. Seeing as your fiance got you the job and all, that, you know. She's lying to you, all right? She just wants to control me. Hmm. So is that where you got it from? I don't want to control you, John. I just want to show you the world. I'll pass. Sydney has stressed all these three weeks thinking about how the woman that I'm falling in love with can treat me like a complete stranger. You've been entertaining dudes like this this whole time and you're going to act like you're proud of it? I can go on dates with whoever I want to, Cairo. I don't... I don't know what you want me to say. You don't have to say a word. Go on all the dates with all the lames in the world. It's never so used a type to settle. Hmm.